Yeah, we came to work, man. It's good when we work on Sunday, you know what I'm saying? Get a little bit of that blessing. Let's say you got the you got the shit tone today, man. I know he's about it though. Hard. He's about yeah, it though. One of the best yeah. Jordans of all time. He's about them elite. But is it the best 14? No. I say yes. No. White red, them second though. Last you know how you feel about the white Last shot. Yeah, no. Last shots are the best. Damn. They the most iconic. They the best. The color wave is fire. Agree. Yeah, I'm gonna go with okay. the last shot. That's the fade to black moment. Yeah, What's but I'm wearing. Yeah, I'm I wearing 14s for the rest of the month. Yeah, that's fire. You got the black and green ones. Yeah, them tough, them hard, bro. I they, remember the um, they the random ones. Though. The white, and, the white and brown ones was the randomest ones that niggas had in high school. White the white and brown 14s. Like, oh yeah, who yeah, yeah. remember them? Yeah. Was fire yeah. though. That them was, was random fire. as hell. Yeah, them was fire. Yeah, niggas thought about the Ferraris. I like the Ferraris too though. The real ones. Yeah. yeah, them was fine. Now, too. when they got to the yellows, yeah, I got the, the yellow. I got the yellows. I got to relax. You out of pocket. I'm wearing them next year. Yes. T don't. got the blue ones too, though. Them hard too. Yeah, I do. Oh, yeah. Laney's boys, yeah. them tough. I'm wearing that the red suede. Yeah. That, that red suede was fire. It's, hold on. That red suede or the red 21s? The wear suede 21 Jordans? 14s, 14s. Ooh, yeah. easy like that? Or the yeah. rage, the best suede is the Raging Bull 5. So. The OGs? Oh. Yes. The OGs, is, they was elite, bro. Ooh, I forgot. Damn. Yeah, Ooh, I was gonna say those over the raging yeah. bull fives. Nah, when that pack first came out, Man, that was that different. Was crazy. Yeah. Niggas slutted them out the last two years. When that pack first came out, that was a different time. That was my first fit in the club in Atlanta. Remember, the <laughs> raging bull fives. <laughs> raging bull fives of Levi's and a uh, polo. You picked the only jeans that could cuff around that yep. shoe. <laughs> Facts, and they was thirty eight. So. It's cool. My fight. nigga was getting money. He just didn't know no better. Yeah, yet. I did. Yeah, I still don't. <laughs> <laughs> Okay. <laughs> Speaking of drawers, though, the Levens drop. It's always funny seeing the Christmas drawers every year because you already see niggas who had that list and in high school. You always see everybody talking about them. Yeah. So we came back that next Monday. You see who didn't who didn't get that cut. Shout yeah. out to BD. Mama. I just bought another pair today. Your mama ain't getting that line. She wasn't dedicated. Oh, that's tough. That's Carol Teague never got in that line. <laughs> you, you can't send mom to Lafayette Square. He was out of pocket. And she, I asked for Christmas gifts. She ain't get it. My sister right. sat in that line for sure. Damn. What was y'all best Christmas Jordan y'all got? Man, I got PTSD from that shit. Because I went out the day that they did the Fire Red release with the Black Tongues. Yeah. That's the same day they did the Burgundy Fives. So okay. I was in Devereaux's at 6 a.m., bro. I was like 6 in line. About 8 o'clock rolled around. They put a sign on the door in them burgundies. They said, we got size 6, 7, and 10. I was hurt. I never got no LeBron. I don't think I ever got no Jordans for Christmas, but my favorite shoe on Christmas, my mama went to Tennessee and got me the white and gold three LeBron. Ooh, I got them too. That's Christmas. back when that was uh, region limited. Yeah, yeah. that's when my, me and her relationship changed for the better of the good. <laughs> I got them for Christmas too that same year. Yeah. But my best Christmas was uh, I ended up getting the Jordan. It was some Concords when I was little. Damn. When the Concourse first came out, I was so hyped, but they got stolen. So when I lived in Gateway, my daddy used to have a big ass, uh, like a murder van. What you call them shits? An Astro van. Oh, you yeah. You know, the kidnapper van the or whatever you want to call it. Yeah. So he had an Astro van. He used to leave the door unlocked all the time. And they came in there, he left my shoes in there, and they got me. And then the next day, we went and bought some Boings. Damn. The Boings had came out. You was the Gallions? I don't know where we went. They cost like 200 though. My dad was sick. He was like, you better. You better have the best game of your life. You better have 20 points. Uh, nigga, it's your fault. Yeah, I was like, nigga, you left him in the car. Like, my mama said that because he was like, nah, we just going to wear his old shoes. I'm like, no, you're going to go buy him some more because she bought them. Yeah. She's like, you're going to go buy some more. My pops. You got some boing. Some boing. Yeah, the first VC was VCs, crazy. VCs, yeah. What color you get? The white, uh, the black, gray, and blue. Mm. The first ones. The yeah. First one. yeah. I wanted the, the silver, one. black, and purple ones. Yeah, I know you're talking about. But yeah. you had the harder ones. Nah, yeah, I had the first one. I couldn't get into them. I liked them. I just couldn't get into them shoes, bro. Them was like, I like versatile shoes growing up. So that's a strictly like a hooping shoe, bro. Yeah, when I was your little, everything was versatile. Me, I wore my shit with yeah. whatever, nigga. Yeah, yeah everything I was, was out getting of pocket. Bro. I wore Vince Carter's the first day of school in high school. With some jeans? Nah, I had on shorts, white and gray ones. Damn. You what you, you? Yeah, I do. Uh, but I'm saying you probably had on hoop shorts. Nah, I had some jean shorts. <laughs> <laughs> Nigga, we was fresh in a bitch. The whole, the My whole crew. Nigga, you was not fresh. The whole crew had them bitches on. I'm going to show you. Y'all know T, what Vince Carter I was talking to. Yep. T, T, you was T, dusty, T. Do you remember your first high school fit? Your first uh, day? First high school fit? For sure. 
Uh, it was a FUBU jersey. This is when, uh, yeah. I don't know if the world know about Value City, but Value City had the first FUBU. This is before Platinum FUBU got rocking. And I had them. Platinum FUBU. Uh, some hard, we had, we wore hard boy outfits back in my day. Thanks. Hard boy fit, and I always had Fazos. I kept Damn. Fazos. Yeah. yeah. Then my first day of high school fit, I had some white, I had some all white Air Force Ones. Yeah, it's crazy. And I remember yeah. my mom got me some all white one lows, and I took them back and got the white and green fours. Yeah. Yeah, I was nothing on doubling up on the white like that. That was crazy. I had these, huh? Y'all yeah, remember them? I do. Yeah, these was hard. Dusty feet, the please white and don't gray, bother the me. The white and gray Vince Carter. What Boosie say? Look at these smiling. Them shit wig as fuck. I'm about to order Dude. these hoes. The wig as fuck. The Vince Carter twos. You're not wearing them. Yeah, nah, them terrible. Nigga, I had them on first day My of school. My nigga had them on with some jean shorts. Fresh white tee, some yeah. Nike socks. Nigga, that was a power marketing way back then. We all thought them shoes was going to make us jump higher. Nah, I ain't think that. I thought they was fresh, nigga. Oh, damn. Shout out to Vince Carter. Shout out to Phil. Hughes. Yeah, Phil. 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 Nah, nah, we ain't do that. Okay. My nah. niggas probably had on hoop shorts with theirs. You was probably the only nigga with jeans shorts. I had on, on. some Averex shorts. Uh, niggas want to shout out Averex. Yeah. He definitely was violated the With a best, brand. a big white T, 5X. <laughs> nigga. <laughs> Couldn't even sit down without sitting on my T. Like, what the fuck you talking That's about? That's crazy. Niggas used to wear big ass clothes. My nigga Wag, shout out to Brody. My nigga wore a 44 jeans, bro. And that's crazy. If you know Wag, there's no reason. Thanks, shout bro. out to my boy Hugh. He had some 48 Jabos. <laughs> He buckled them up, bro. <laughs> the the pants the was like this. <laughs> <laughs> and niggas back in that day, bro, we was dusty to the bitch. Niggas didn't even wear leather belts. Niggas wore the, the belts that came with the cargo. Yeah, on God. <laughs> <laughs> that you had to pull through and pull that bitch back. <laughs> <laughs> dusty as hell. Niggas wore Wearing that with denim is nasty as uh, hell. We was so dusty. What the fuck? Oh man. And I used to be shitty when I ain't had that belt. Like, fuck, man. <laughs> I need my real belt, no, man. for real. Because <laughs> wasn't no backup. I used to yeah, keep one of My real belt was like a church belt. Like, I can't wear that. Because, nigga, if you forgot your belt going to school, your whole day was fucked up. Facts. You was looking nuts. Our pants was too big, too, bro. Way too big. And you couldn't have shit in your pockets if you did. And Come you on. got in trouble. I rippled it. We got in trouble for sagging and some yeah. shit. You was doomed, nigga. Ain't Niggas no way. Niggas just give us shoestrings, bro, to put around our shit. <laughs> Ain't no way. I was in the pit for real, nigga. God, bro. Ain't no way my mama used to let me buy 40s. What was my you mama doing? was going. My mama was. She used to take me to Big and Tall in Burlington. Uh, <laughs> you know, I talk about the in Lafayette. <laughs> <That's actually> <laughs> she was like, all right, the Big and Tall back there. I go back there. They got a rock of word 6X. Uh, Gotta have it. She's like, that's a little big, ain't it? Nah, I remember one time she bought me a 3X. I told my mama it was too tight. I was like, damn, I really can't move. I used to hoop in the 4X, too. Me, too. Start my game off in the 4X, switch to a 5X at halftime. That's damn. crazy. Yeah. yeah, I was wearing shorty for sure. That's why Larry hated you. <laughs> Probably. I was out of pocket. I wonder if T-shirts are still like five for 20. No. I ain't bought no package like that in the Champs in a long I time. Need, I need them, though, if that is. I'm, I'm like, in. what kind of quality does Champs have now with the T-game? Nigga, I went to uh, JD Sports, and they said, nah, we don't got T's. We got them Nike ones, though, and they are $30 a piece. So, yeah, man, y'all got yeah, it. I'm cool. What's your favorite brand of T as a grown man? Like, what y'all, today, if you had to go buy a pack of teas, what pack, what brand y'all grabbing? Shit, the Polo's still undefeated, but. Polo got I'm one weird though. Klein, nigga. Calvin Me too. Klein got the best socks, yeah. too. Yeah, you fuck with the Calvin Klein I fuck socks. with Calvin Klein socks. Matter of fact, you go I got them on now. <laughs> you tap in? Yeah, yeah tap nigga, in. Tap nah, in. The Calvin Klein tea is crazy. Yeah. Damn. I like Calvin Klein everything. Three pack, for I sure. I like Polo draws, though, for some reason. Like, Calvin Klein draws, they, like, too short. Ah. So, uh, yeah. You know what I mean? They be kind of, like. Yeah, I'm still a hang yeah, because I'm a little heavy down there. <laughs> shit, I'm a hang. Hey, pause, bro. You know that note? Yeah, let's talk about something. Yeah. This nigga work, bro. I need something to stretch. <laughs> yeah, bro. OG nuts. 